Hi, my name's Dave Baker. I'm Clinical Director at Complete Physio. And today I'm gonna to be answering some of the most frequently asked questions about ultrasound guided injections. We'll be injecting steroid and local anesthetic, which are obviously two painkillers. And we use ultrasound as a way of visualizing inside the tissues of your body so that we can actually put the needle precisely where we want the injection to go. The ultrasound sends a sound wave into the body's tissues. The sound waves are bounced back up to the probe and it allows us to see very clearly the different tissues within the body and the needle shows up very, very nicely. So we're able to be very precise in terms of needle placement, we're able to be very precise exactly where we can inject the drug. When we're using ultrasound guidance to perform an injection, um, we are able to identify exactly the um, target area to inject. This allows us to um, be very precise with the needle placement and significantly reduces the chances of any tissue trauma while the injection is being performed. Sometimes people experience some post-injection discomfort. Again, this is um, offset with the use of local anaesthetic, which we use in the vast majority of our injection procedures. Sometimes um, the area of the injection may be a little sore the next day as the steroid works its way into the tissue. And again, your, um, your clinician will advise you on the best way to offset this, manage it and minimise it. A steroid injection will usually give relief for around sort of, usually sort of two, three, four months. Then the question is, does the patient feel that now they're able to manage it and they can continue with exercise and home-based program? Each time the person has an injection, it does create a sort of window of opportunity for them to really go off and, and exercise. Physiotherapy, manual therapy, if they wish to do that as well, can be, again, very effective within that period, particularly. 